Well, I'm kicked back in my room today. It's uh, May 25th, 2024. Thought I'd uh, do a little bit of rambling, but before I do my rambling, I want to I want to give you my appreciation for all the subscribers who have joined my channel. Um, I had to restart my channel at the end of December of 2022, so I've only been back in business less than a year and a half. But I had, uh, up until I lost my previous channel, I had a uh, hundred and, uh, excuse me, a thousand, like 1,600 plus subscribers. And this is Daphne. This is my little girl who's been with me since 2011. And, uh, of course, I have my dog, D Dublin. He's in the room laying down on, on a pillow right now. <laughs> anyway, hey, say hi, Daphne. Say hi to the folks out there in YouTube land. Say hey. Okay. All right. Seriously, though, I want to thank all of you who have joined my channel. I will tell you that I have... I have gained I believe several actually many new friends from all over the United States and uh, overseas uh, I thought about just shouting out individual names that are on YouTube that who I consider are friends but I don't want to embarrass them but you probably know who you are uh, and every one of you who I consider my friends, I would have no qualms whatsoever if you ever came to my area from, if you lived in the United States and you traveled down south and wanted to come this way, I would welcome you into my home and uh, try to show you a few things around the area. The same thing goes for my good friends that are located overseas. I mean, I've got them in several different countries, Poland, the Netherlands, uh, England, uh, that's just off the top of my head, uh, so, and others, other countries there. Uh, but if you ever have a, take a trip to the United States, I would really be honored if you would include uh, the area of the country where I live, which is in northwest Florida. It's called the Panhandle of Florida. I'm uh, in Pensacola, Florida and it, it's, it's, I won't say it's God's country because where I was raised about 40 miles above, up the road north I was raised in South Alabama. Now that I do consider as God's country. But this area right here in Pensacola uh, it's 90% it's God's country. I, I have to say that so uh, but if you ever get down this way, look, we got the beaches, we got the ocean, take you deep sea fishing, and just show you around, let you see what it's like to live in this area of the country. The living expenses, is, expenses are relatively low compared to other areas of the country. Uh, granted, you know, some of the things that we have to pay taxes on are are uh, not so much taxes because this state is uh, you don't have to pay state income taxes but the state gets you on insurance premiums home and uh, vehicle insurance premiums but still they are much lower than other states uh, but you know I'm thankful I'm, I have a beautiful home and I'll, I'll probably go ahead and walk outside and show you a little bit of where my home is what it looks like <coughs> and let you see uh, uh, my uh, where I live how how I live and uh, you know what makes uh, think, makes me happy I'm at that juncture of life you know it's like I look at my baby picture about I'm about six months old six or eight months old taken in 1950 because I was born in November 49 and uh, I look at that and I close my eyes and and I wake up and then it's seven decades later 
where has time gone? It flies by. It really does. Uh, it's a proven fact that as you get older, time does fly by faster. Why? I don't know, but there's a psychological aspect of it that, uh, <coughs> that in essence says time does go by faster as you age. So I look back on um, all the stuff that I've done over my life. Uh, I've had a good life. I really have. Uh, ups and downs all the way, like everybody. Uh, but I'm content. Uh, with my lot in life. I didn't become famous, rich and famous, like I wanted to, uh, just the way it goes sometimes, but, uh, you know, uh, reflecting back, I wouldn't trade what I have now for anything in the world. I have a beautiful home. I have, uh, well, I was going to say beautiful, I have a beautiful wife first. I have a nice home. My wife and I have been married uh, 40, oh boy, 45 years. And, uh, you know, through its ups and downs, we've been very happy. We've had three children. And uh, one of my children lives, one of my children lives in uh, Virginia. And another one lives uh, here in uh, Pensacola, or near us here in this area only about six miles away so it's a, it's thrilling that to me and to my wife that our, our that one of our ch children are are living close to us and we get to see our grandchildren my daughter and her husband uh they have two children and one one's birthday was uh will be uh yes it was yesterday turned three and the other baby is uh eight months old uh, mm, what is his birthday uh, in, in a day or so I guess I, I can't roughly they are uh, so it's beautiful beautiful kids and you know we're just thankful that we have one of our ch children here living near us and my wife and I get to keep keep them uh, during the week you know different days of the week and so we, we get to spend a lot of time uh, with with the, with the grandchildren. My wife had a birthday on the 21st a few days ago. So, and uh, how old is she? Well, she's, I'm not going to tell you that. She'd shoot me if I told you how old she was. Uh, but, and then my daughter has a birthday uh, Monday. And, uh, and she's not, I'm not going to tell you her age either. Now, she really would have a fit. But she and her husband uh, are doing quite well. And got two wonderful, wonderful children. Bless their hearts. I love my grandchildren. And be, hey, for sure, though, <laughs> getting on up there in age, I said, Honey, are we ever going to have grandchildren? For a while, it looked like we were. But we have been blessed with with two grandchildren at this time. My my son who lives in uh, in Virginia, he's a confirmed bachelor. And uh, so we don't expect him to get married and have children. Though who knows, he may fool us one day and he's 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 got his life. He's enjoying it up there in Virginia. He he plays professionally in, in, in a band and uh, he does have a job up there and he's doing quite well and in fact he'll be coming down to visit with us in a few weeks stay about a week with us don't get to see him as much as we want to but you know we're thankful when we can see him uh, we do go up there to see him we have done that a couple of times and uh, he comes down either in the summer or in the uh, Christmas season uh, to visit with us so you know all in all I guess that's a good thing 